In this video, I am going to explain you about second type of flow of control method. It is a selection. In selection, the execution of statement depends on the condition. Here, statements in an algorithm may not always execute in sequence. Like means uh, a statement doesn't execute uh, like in this way, first statement, then second statement, then so on. In selection, the group of statements or you can say one statement depends on the condition and the result of condition is either true or false. Means those statements which depends on the true result of condition executes when the condition is true and when the condition is false then statement depending on the result of uh, condition that is false then they executes. So this is the diagram uh, of a flowchart uh, to explain uh, about selection construct or you can say selection control flow here in a diamond it is a condition the result of condition is either true or false this statement or you can say s means there may be one statement or more than one statement uh, means when the condition uh, is true then these statement execute and when the result of condition is false then the rest of the code executes like here uh, one example you have to check the input number is even or odd means uh, if the number is uh, divisible by 2 then the number is even if the number is uh, if the number is not divisible by 2 then the result is false or you can say uh, when the number is not divisible by 2 then such type of number is odd this is the pseudo code of uh, this uh, example first input number that is input num remainder equal to num divided by 2 here uh, I have used uh, this division or either you can write another type of division or you can write in this way num divided by 2. Whatever the symbol actually I am not getting in keyboard this one in, uh, for uh, mathematical division. So you can use a slash basically it is used in a program and then if remainder equal to 0 then display num is even number else means if the uh, condition is false then this statement executes it displays the number is odd number like here one example uh, the map in your neighborhood actually this uh, diagram i have taken from the ncrt book of computer science so uh, here there are some questions is there a predefined route for walking from home to school? You see here, uh, the, this is the school and uh, there are different different roads to go to the school. Can we have different route while coming back? Yeah, there are different routes. Uh, uh, means you see here, these are the means the bus is going on and so many things are going on by the route. As seen from the map, there can be multiple routes between home and school. We might take shortest route in the morning, but while coming back home in the afternoon, the shortest route might have traffic, heavy traffic. Therefore, we could uh, take another route with less traffic. Here the above problem involves some decision making based on certain condition. Let us uh, look at some other example while decision making is dependent on certain condition. Actually the purpose of the diagram uh, is to uh, means uh, define different routes from home to school. Means uh, this is not a sequential construct. Actually it is a decision making construct. So decision making is also called as uh, selection control flow. Here checking eligibility of voting. When the age of the person is uh, more than 18, 18, then person is eligible for vote. Otherwise, person is not eligible for vote if uh, the age of the person is less than 18. Now, if a student is 8 years old and uh, the student likes maths, put the student in group A, otherwise put the student in group B. Such type of uh, means uh, statements we face in our real life outcome 
एट ईयर ओल्ड राजू हु डज नॉट लाइक मैथ्स ग्रुप बी एट ईयर ओल्ड प्रीति हु लाइक्स मैथ्स ग्रुप ए सेवन ईयर ओल्ड अनिश हु लाइक्स मैथ्स ग्रुप बी हेयर द कंडीशनल मीन्स कंट्रोल सो कंस्ट्रक्ट हैव एलग्रेट न If condition in angular brackets, we usually write the condition. Then the steps to be taken when the uh, condition is true or means you can say fulfilled. Write an algorithm to check whether a number of odd is or even. Already I have explained this one. This is the flow chart of the previous uh, algorithm. Here uh, this flow chart I have made in uh, Microsoft Word. Start then input number is number. This one here modulus uh, operator I have used. Actually such type of operators are used in programming languages. So uh, you don't worry about it uh, such type of operators this time because already uh, means uh, uh, your in your syllabus Python programming is there and uh, in incoming videos I will explain you about Python programming. So that time I will explain about such type of operators. Okay, that's all about uh, uh, this uh, selection control. Though.